is that in your hand, bro? Listen, guys. <laughs> a lot of shit's changed. Lots of change. What was the last time I was on a YouTube video? It's been a minute. I think, uh, I don't even know. Listen, guys. Things are changing. I'm finally done traveling. Working on a bunch of shit. I don't know why this is in my hands. It feels like someone's pouring acid on my hands. <laughs> but, um, I guess you guys you know, are gonna you know. I guess you guys are gonna be the first to know. I'm just not gonna say it because it's just too demoralizing for me. <laughs> but actions are a lot louder than words. But what are we doing today? We are filming um, for our training series, which I don't know if we've even introed yet, but we're filming for our new campaign series, which is for the love of training. And that is basically a premise of athletes talking about why they love training. So um, it's honestly. A lot of what me and the team, Mook, uh, Jackson, Serge, and myself have done is we kind of just like let them train, train super hard, and we kind of, in the moment when your endorphins running, you just kind of ask them like, why do you love training? Give you a little bit of a spiel, turn that into like one of our branding videos, and that's pretty much all we're doing for all of April, just posting that. So today we got Emily, one of our OG athletes, and then tomorrow we got Brett, and then a bunch of other guys. So let's get to it. Because <laughs> I missed my exit. I couldn't even see the end of where the traffic actually was. <laughs> I'll get you like out here. So yeah. like, honestly, I, it's I, like, I'm not, it's not posed on. You know how I shoot. Yeah. So it's just, yeah. Okay. So just do shoulders, arms, um, and then like, yeah, like I'll, maybe at the end I'll get some like other shots, like if you walking around and stuff okay. like that. And like just like resting and just like whatever. Okay. Like, nothing crazy. And okay. then afterwards, afterwards, I'll probably just do like a short little interview, but it's nothing like super set up. The premise of it is it's for our campaign series for the love of training. So I'm literally just going to ask you at the end, like why, what is it that you love so much about training? Sigma 35 1.4 art. Mm. It's a little smooth, easy photo camera, mm. photo rig. Mm. And the photos coming off that are insane. They're so oh, cool. incredible. Here, here. Let's, let's show on. Jack. What's up? Dude, tons of cameras on deck today. What camera are you rocking right now? This is the Fuji XT4 with a 35 millimeter 5. Mm. That's that money. Oh, yeah. What other camera do you have on deck? I got the A7 III over here, the whole rig setup. Hold up. The 35mm Master. Wow. It's a clean, clean setup. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Calvin's rocking a uh, Sony FX6. And he has a G Master 24 to 70 on there right now. He can't talk, so I'm filling in for him. Call this pit stop. It's our it's our it's our it's our first time. <laughs> you get across your heart for what training means to you. In this little note that is going to be put in a bottle and thrown into the ocean, and hopefully someone finds later on. So, what does training mean to you? So. Training to me, when I started, it was about what we, what we love about most of this, and she agreed on, is we hate low ceiling gyms. Like, everyone loves Bev's gym. I don't like Bev's gym because of, <laughs> you feel congested because the ceiling's so low. So, yeah. when you walk in, it's have so much open space. Um, the only thing that would make it better is if the weather wasn't so humid here that you could have like a big big door that opens up. Besides right. that, it's just perfect, you know what I mean? So like, yeah. just so much total square space. The noises that come with this too, like, it has that real gym feel where you can hear everything yeah. echoing around. And Which, yeah, I probably need to be a little more quiet in here. <laughs> oh! Yep! Yes! <laughs> 
<laughs> we did it good. He just fumbled the bag. All right. 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 We just shot all like the new product, yeah, new merch drops, new products, and then now we're gonna <laughs> shoot basically a lot of the training footage with some different athletes for the branding video, which is gonna be pretty much all athlete focused, no really products. And uh, the rest of the day, we're gonna get kind of fill in the rest of the stuff. So we might do a warehouse kind of video, um, and then this whole week until Thursday, I guess all of Thursday, we're gonna be shooting different companies. So some bum tomorrow. Um, a lot of uh, revive and then relive the rest of the day. So we're, just, we're cramming it all in because it's a lot. And so we have this whole itinerary list, which today we're getting through. So we should finish everything. And then the rest of the day is we've got to get a hustle. So it's going to be awesome. we got the team. It's going to be sick. We're grinding. We're grinding. Do it. All right, let's put that light all the way down. Yeah. And they're like, whoa. And then you'll see the baseball. Action. And up. That's sick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> yeah, actually, we're done. Here we You said you had your first website debut? I did. How'd it go? It's kind of spooky. It was like so awkward. I didn't even know what to do. <laughs> How was your trip? The trip was fantastic. But you sound less than pleased. Like three hours of sleep every day of the entire week. But, you know, that's what it takes to win brand of the year at Vitamin Shop. Yeah. Enough said. That was it. Sam's phone was good. Everything was good. Couldn't have gotten better. I'm just very tired. Well, I'll have you back. Mm. All right, first taste. How is it? It's actually pretty good. I like that. It's on like not of, too heavy. On a scale of root beer to root beer, what is it? Like a root beer. That's what I would say. Root beer. <laughs> I like it. You like his new Mac? What? You like his new Mac? Well, wow, two people switched devices. Calvin switched to Sony, and you switched to Mac. Bunch of pussies caving into peer pressure. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, first off, yeah. Yeah. if, if we want to talk about pussies caving into peer pressure, endurance is so dumb. Post a 5 a.m. run. Yeah. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Got him! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the way you look just jealous. And I, I didn't actually say endurance. I didn't know Mook was filming. <laughs> Dan loves endurance. He's so passionate. I've never seen such jealousy in my life. <laughs> Listen, I am jealous. I can't make a quarter mile without stopping. So. I changed your drink of damn brunch. Just <laughs> light myself on fire first. Dude, what is happening? Rip. <laughs> I can't you completely understand this. Yes. I think that would make much sense. What is this? What is this belt actually? What is the belt for? Read it, bro. Mmm. That's that, huh? You must have won. You won the bench press competition? Yeah, bro. Bench like fucking like 125 and shit. Like huh? What's that belt for? That belt is for the bench press competition that we're holding at the Raw Gym Grand Opening. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have different weight classes for men and women. And it's gonna be how many you can bench for like reps. So you know, 180 and under is 225, and then the weight goes up for reps. And then the winner is gonna get that championship belt. It's a legit metal belt, leather. Pretty much a WWE belt. So it's not plastic or anything, it's solid metal. And you get it pre pre abused by Calvin. Yeah. 
<laughs> first one that someone gets is going to be abused by Calvin. It's probably going to have dents and everything in it. <laughs> I'm going to be standing there like an NPC.